Situation on the front lines as of February 22, 2023. On the Belarusian and Cybersky direction, a two-week training of border guards has started in Belarus, during which they will fight partisans and saboteurs. In general, the situation remains unchanged. The enemy is constantly learning, and we are building a dense defense of the northern borders. On the Svatov direction, there are no global changes. The tweet of a fighter that went viral about four kilometers in Kremina describes the situation over the past month. Indeed, we had to retreat three to four kilometers in the forest, as you can see on the map. On the Bakhmut direction, part or all of Berkhivka is captured by the enemy. The situation is being clarified. Fighting is going on in Yahidni. On the eastern bank, the enemy is slowly but surely pushing our forces to the river. The situation in the south of the city is stable. On the Avdivka direction, pressure on our positions continues from Novobakhmutivka. On the Zaporizhia and Tavria direction, no changes. Analytical note. Again and again we talk about the dire situation in Bakhmut. The Eastern Bank now raises the question of whether it makes sense to keep it in such conditions and for how long. In the North, the situation generally raises certain fears. The enemy has reached 200 meter heights and is squeezing our troops out of Berkhivka, if they have not already done so. To understand, everything is lower to the road from Kromov. 